get horribly pink. Pink. My mother. She told me no end. She told me no end. If you got a tooth, you got a friend. If you got a tooth, you got a friend. I was young then. I was young then. And careless. I am careless. My toothbrush was hairless. My toothbrush was hairless. I never had much time to spend. I never had much time to spend. Are you okay, Shabika? I really didn't have to do it. Oh, you should tell me so. Here's the
Um, I'll give back for you. The poem begins in first person. The poet Persona says she wish she had looked after her teeth if she had looked after them and not had all those toffees and sweet sticky things. There might not have been any danger lurking beneath the dentist's there. Yes, means she is regret that she eats so many um, chocolate sweet whatsoever that the tooth is um not good in good condition. Okay, so this poem is about regretting on something. Okay, let's move to stanza two. Someone read out loud for me. Anyone? Okay. I wish I'd been that much more willing When I had more tooth there than feeling To be hot box poppers From respect to me toppers And to buy something else with me silly Alright Okay At stanza 2, the poet person says Here that she wishes she were more willing to give up box toppers And buy something else with her allowance um, then she still had more teeth than feeling. Um, you know that feeling? Yes. That used to feel uh, the the blank, the, the pole, yeah, the pole um, at your teeth. Alright, understand everyone? Yes. yes. Okay, now that her teeth um, are almost filled artificially, um, she realized mistake. Alright? Okay, let's go to stanza 3. Someone? Read it out loud for me. I know. Uh, make the extra effort 
uh, or properly of cleaning um, out the spaces between two teeth. She hardly made use of verifying methods of brushing and flossing. She admits that at the time it didn't seem more um, the time and energy because um, according to her, as long as she could bite, her teeth will seem fine. Alright? Okay. Um, anyone has trouble understanding this form? No? No? Okay. Then let's move to stanza 6. Anyone? Anyone? Come on. It's like for me. Oh, 
what? What is, okay, let me ask you, what is them being referred to in the first law? Shafika, can you answer for me? Okay, and then C. 
see what are liquorice and sherbet sherbetes. Okay. I think the correct uh, is a type of candy. Mm -hmm. uh, and sherbet decks. Sherbet decks. Sherbet decks. Uh, 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 a type of sweets. Okay, correct. Okay, let's move to question that you have to answer. You have to write it. Okay, you have to write. Okay, I want you to um, copy uh, the question, alright? Okay. What? Are the different kinds of sweets? First question. What are the different kinds? Of sweet? That the poet ate? Which led Okay. 
Okay. Question six. Why does the child find rushing a useless activity? Why? Kenapa? Budak-budak ni kan? Dia ingat bawa gigi ni tak penting. Useless. Faham? Straight. My friends are in the bathroom getting hot 
higher than the Empire State. My lover, she is waiting for me just across the bar. My seat's been taken by some sunglasses, asking about a scar. And I know I gave it to you months ago. I know you're trying to forget. But between the drinks and subtle things, the holes in my apologies, you know, I'm trying hard to take it back. So if by the time the bar closes and you feel like falling down, I'll carry you home tonight. And you feel like falling down I'll carry you home tonight Right there on top of the moon We could sit and do nothing I wish we were both Okay, thumbs up everyone! Okay, let's go to let discuss the answer Question one Um
let's move to question two. Why has the line Oh, I wish I look after me thick been repeated so many times in this poem? Can you tell me? Answer? Zuba. You mean Zuba? Yeah. 
Okay, let's just say. I want give up. Um, why does the child find brushing a useless activity? The child found brushing a useless activity because she was ignorant about their dental hygiene at that time. Mm -hmm. She casually brushed her teeth and thus and dust and thus found mm -hmm. them pretty. Okay. I really like Ipa. Her voice is loud and clear. I think everyone should give up as a sample, okay? Especially Ainu. Because I didn't hear your voice. Your voice is so soft. Oh, okay, okay, sorry, teacher. Okay. Next, Shavika. What thrills did the poet spot? Louder and clear. Like I said. The poet. <laughs> the poet. The poet? The poet. Louder, louder. The poet spot thrills that this cavity. Yes. These cavities are caused by the cities. Whoa, whoa, whoa. The, the cavities? These cavities mm -hmm. were caused yes. by the eating fish and sticky stuff and by the neck and arm. Nick, yeah. Nick, yeah. Ah, okay. Question A. How does the poem successfully awaken the reader to his dental hygiene and care? I know. I want I know. <laughs> I want you. I want to. Okay, okay. Let me try my best. Okay, louder, louder, and clear. Spend, spend money on health and nutrition. On 
one healthy. Yeah. Right? Nutritious. Nutritious. Nutritious food that will have made the teeth strong and healthy. Yes. She should not have waste money on wasted. Wasted money on buying should not must uh must Thank you very much.